Hello, I'm Dr. Deborah Davis, Director of Pittsburgh Center for Environmental Oncology. Come on in, I want to show you a few things in our office, how we walk the talk of recycling. You see, these bookshelves, they were once that ugly institutional color and pretty dinged up, and they were put off into a garage to be uh, sent away to the dump. We uh, bought a gallon of magnetized paint, and that gallon of paint, which cost $50, applies color in a magnetized booth so that there's no emissions of paint whatsoever. So we have bookshelves, we have file cabinets, and all of those things are basically recycled. We're also using uh, office furniture that was sent off because people wanted different things, but it was perfectly feasible to use it. And we uh, have artwork here made by uh, Davia Davis, who has a very large display at the Pittsburgh airport of Pittsburgh in the past and Pittsburgh today. And that's my hometown of Denora, where in 1948, 60 years ago, 20 people dropped dead from air pollution in a short period of time. And that town gave birth to the development of environmental protection throughout the world because people understood that if a lot of pollution could kill people in a healthy, working class town in a short period of time, we had better pay more attention to what pollution does to the rest of us over longer periods of time. And so our Center for Environmental Oncology is working today to make prevention the cure for cancer, understanding that we can work together to come up with greener and healthier things to do. The business community is thriving as it's going green today. Green is the new black in the fashion world, and green is the new red, white, and blue because the major American companies that are going green are doing well even in this economic downturn. Thank you. I'm Deborah Davis.